Hello, and welcome to Food for Cossacks. No, Sergey, Sergey, it's Food for Vikings. Can I bring my okay. show you the guest? Okay. So let's say it together. Okay. Hello, Hello and, and welcome, welcome to, to Food, Food for, for Vikings. Vikings. Today, I have a special guest, as you can see. This is Sergey, my best buddy from Ukraine that lives in Canada. He invited me in to stay with him, but that didn't work out, and he kind of kicked me out. But this is my place, it's nice. Well, I mean, you never paid rent, so, you know. <laughs> We weren't going to talk about that on the show. Just wait till after and okay. we'll deal with it. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Anyway, today we're going to make a delicious and wonderful and fantastic pizza pierogi. No, 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 no. It's pierogi pizza. There is difference. The difference between uh, pizza pierogi and pierogi pizza is pierogi pizza is a pizza crust with only tomato sauce. You throw a chunk of pierogi on it, you have to cream, totally It's going to be delicious. We're going to have bacon and sausage and everything. Do I like sausage? Oh, I'm sure you do. Wait, wait. Okay, let's just get cracking at it, shall we? Okay, let's go. So we pre-peeled some of the potatoes just to make things a little more easy and streamlined. I insisted that we save one potato so that I may show you the proper technique for peeling a potato. First you want to grab your little paper here. It's designed specifically for peeling. Then you just grab the edge. First of all, you don't use paper for cutting, for peeling potatoes. You use potato peeling. You do it like this. You peel it towards you. Make sure you get the shaft and everything. Then build it on the base. No, 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 no. You do not. You do not want to just blow on it. I want to get all the dirt. Where's your? Then you would cut to rub it in. Rub it in, nice. That will dissolve any bacteria and dirt, and then you're good to go. Problem solved. Cut, cut, cut. Sergey, what the hell? You can't just spit on the potato. We're putting that in the food. What the hell? Why not? We are going to boil it, it will kill all bacteria, and you know that's what we do at Homeland. Okay. Okay. Uh, let's cut the shit up. First, you want to get your bitch peeler <laughs> out of the way. When you cut up all your potatoes, you're gonna wanna boil them. So get some pot, I mean your pot, and fill it with water. Exactly, so you must listen to me. When I tell you to do something, you do it. Okay, so you put it on the burner and you put it on mass. You want to boil the shit out of it. Do, uh, do we put salt? No, you know, there's no way you put salt in it. Yes, so what are you doing here? There's not enough water. There's nowhere near enough, there's nothing in that way. So you put a lot of water, not a little bit, obviously. Okay, here you go. There is your pot. No, no, no. You don't put it on the little wood burner, you put it on big burner. Little burner is for sissy. Are you a little bitch? No, you're supposed to be a Viking. I'm just trying to conserve energy. Conserving energy means less quick boil. Do you want this to go quickly or not? Yes, I want it to go quickly. And there we go. It is settled. Why did we get Polish sausage? I thought we were going to use Ukrainian. We are supposed to use Ukrainian sausage. Why did you go grab Polish sausage? Happens. We are making Ukrainian dish here, why would you grab a Polish sausage? You know, I know there's some debate between Progi's original country, but you know what? Freaking came from the Ukraine. Came from the Ukraine, we use Ukrainian ingredients only. Okay, 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 the potatoes were from Idaho. Never mind, just what do we do with the sausage? Okay, so first... Mind or kind of distracting me? 
Do you need the hands? No, of course I do not need the hands. Get out of the frying pan. Go get the frying pan. Oh. So you take your frying pan out and you put it on the thing and you put it on low. Cut your sausage. Well, how do you cut it? Well, for starters, you want to cut it into little bits. As you're doing things with little bits, make sure they are done cut everything stick. Then, after you get that done, just cut it in half. You have a gift. And you got to be careful to watch your water while you're doing this shit. Because sometimes it gets naughty and just explodes all over the place. Look, you're cutting really shitty. Let me do it. That is not what you should be using. If you're going to use a cleaver, you at least want to use a real one. I was going to wait and give this to you gift after the show, but now I'm going to be forced to use it. That's so nice. Yes, yes it is. This was your gift, your welcoming gift to Canada, and now you're ruining it because now I'm using it anyway. Okay, so when you cut your sausage up, you want to move over to the bacon because we like to put bacon in everything because it's delicious. So let's have a look here. Oh, what are you doing? What are you doing? No, 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 no. No, no. This is this was my pig. Why am going to cut him? This pig was in my family for generations. Now. Just let me have this. Okay. I don't ask you for a lot in this show. All I want to do. Cut my own pig, okay? Put that pig over there. What pig? What are you talking about? There's no pig. It's just a dish rack. Hey! What was that? That was dumb. Why? What were you trying to make me see things? Like, anyway. No distractions aside, before we start frying. I would like to say a quick little prayer in remembrance of this pig. He was in my family for generations. And you know, he was always good to me. Unfortunately, back in the age. And really there was nothing. What was that for? So anyway, let's just cut the shit and let's get cracking at it. You cut it again, it's quite easy. Just go chop. Then chop. It looks looks. I guess he wanted dices. Did you want dice? Oh. Anyway, just get it going. Try not to cut your fingers. Yeah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Now once you get all your baking cut up and all your sausages, you throw it in the frying pan. Obviously. You want to use some oil? You put a little bit. No, oh, more than that. You just like squeeze it a little bit and, you know, just pretend like you're going through the intestines of the enemy trying to find loot. Because sometimes they hide shit in your bowels. Some people are weird like that. Okay, so when you cut up all your chives, you want to move over to the onion, obviously. And you don't even hit me with proper frying pan! You hit me with little bitch thing! This is a proper frying pan! You hit me with this! This will knock me out immediately! What are you trying to pull? I don't know, I just get passionate sometimes and I get carried away. And... <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm... You know what, I'm sorry. I've been hard on you. I get passionate myself. This is cooking from my homeland. This is something that me and my family have been making for years. No one else has done it until we did. So I feel really close to home with it. So you know what? I'm sorry. I will go easier on you for now. Okay. You cut all your vegetables and you eat and shit and fry it all up. You mash your potatoes. I make my potatoes. You always need to put milk. What? 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 You forgot the butter. Oh. Oh. Come on, mash all Wait 
What do you like to do for sport? I like to pillage. What kind of tactics are you using? Pillaging! As you can see, the Viking has no clue what the hell he's doing. Pillage your ex. I win. Viking! So what else do you like to do? Do you have a hot spot, hobby, sport? I like to drink vodka. No, but I mean like, do you play like tennis or so badminton? It's fun. I play vodka pong every Saturday at noon. Okay, let's just check on the pizza. Okay. So, I'm pretty sure it's ready. So we'll have a look. It smells delicious. Oh, that looks good. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, yeah. So once you have it out of the oven, let it sit for a little bit. And then you cut it up and you serve that shit and put it in here. to make the, the filming a bit smoother, but... But, but potato? <laughs> I'm just gonna show you. <laughs> it's fun. I play vodka pong every Saturday at noon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was good. That was so good. <laughs>